Okay, so I sat under the dryer for about 20 minutes with not a Walmart bag on my head, but a Kroger bag because I shop at Kroger too. Um, I've rinsed out my pre poo my hair. Actually, I can already start to feel it. Oh, it's really soft. I haven't even shampooed it yet. I haven't washed it yet. So it's wet now, and I'm actually about to wash it. It feels good. It feels really nice. Um, so I wanted to talk to you about my shampoo. Now, even when uh, during my hairstyling days, uh, when I was, you know, in my heyday, I actually always, always to this day, always used Cream of Nature shampoo. I would recommend this shampoo and honestly it's not just something that I've only seen work on my hair this is something that I've actually seen work on almost every person's hair whose hair I wash including mine cream of nature the regular one we're not talking about you know any of the other ones but this one right here it basically works as you know, it cleans well, it detangles excellently. I remember um, when I used to, um, back in the day when we used to, after we would relax our hair, we would rinse it out, and after it was rinsed, and you wash it with the neutralizing shampoo, please remember, if you relax your hair, use a neutralizing shampoo when you wash it. Uh, but after the neutralizing shampoo, a lot of times, the hair would be so hard. It was so, so hard. And sometimes even after certain conditioners were put in the hair, the hair would still be hard. But all we had to do was take some of this. So all I did was take some of this right here and just run it through the hair one good time. And immediately, instantly, it softens the hair. So I'm sorry. This is probably something I'm going to use forever. Whatever the ingredients are that people don't agree with, you know, which is understandable, you know, to each his own. But I will probably use this forever. Probably. I never say, you know, I'll never, you know. But most likely I'll be using this forever. Um, but what I do is I like to mix the cream of nature with the coconut milk uh, shampoo. When I use this coconut milk shampoo, it actually, it doesn't necessarily make the hair as soft as the cream of nature does. But what it does do is that it gives my hair a fresh feel it feels fresh and it doesn't feel way down it just feels fresh and I love the way that feels so I actually am about to uh, my clothes stop drying so I'm actually going to put my shampoo mixture in my hair I'm going to wash it while I'm in the shower and then after that I'm going to put in my conditioner um, this probably is going to seem like it's a lot longer than it actually is. And I know that everyone doesn't have a lot of time to spend on their hair washing and conditioning and everything. This is not taking as much time as it looks like it's taking, but I really want to show you what I do. Um, you know, if that matters, if you're interested. It's just nice to know that you're here with me. I love you. So I'm going to wash my hair while I'm in the shower because I'm preparing to actually get out of the house at some point today. Exactly, yes. I'm going to be doing all this and I'm going to get out of the house today. So um, I'm about to wash it. And when I come back, we'll be conditioning it and then we'll style it, okay? So I'm guessing that'll probably be about maybe two more videos. Who knows? I might beat my face today. Who knows? I might even beat the face. Beat the face. Um, I'm a MAC cosmetics junkie. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Anything I put on my lips is MAC. Anything I put on my face is MAC. Now my eyelashes, that might be a different story. That's a different story. We'll talk about that another time. But yeah, for now, it's the hair. And um, I really do hope I'm, I'm helping somebody. Um, if you have any questions, you can just let me know. You can post them below. Post your questions. Or you can PM me. Please subscribe. I'd love to have some more subscriptions. Get to know some of you a little better. And um, here we go. All right, I'll see you in a few. Yeah, yeah.